today we are in Rhodes, uh, old town in Greece and uh, we are going to find out what uh, people do after the summer season and how the life is uh, here uh, in winter time. So let's find out. Everything uh, seems like normal. Quiet day in Rhodes Old Town. But the only reason why uh, these uh, shops and places are open are because uh, there are some cruise ships uh, coming in and a few times a week most of the shops uh, open again just for that. But otherwise uh, it's all closed and it feels like a coast town. Today we are lucky to come here and see while the shops are open and uh, in this video I will show you a beautiful Ellie Beach without umbrellas and without sunbeds and that's the main reason why Ellie Beach is the best beach if there is no umbrellas or sunbeds. I will show you later. Meanwhile, uh, when I walk to the other place... ...which I want to show you... Uh, ...I will uh, talk about our life here in Rhodes, Greece and how we are doing. We have been here for eight months already and I must say it's... Uh, it has been a crazy road so far. As you can see, there are still some uh, tourists, but most of them are coming from cruise ships. Otherwise there would be zero people here. We have been in uh, Rhodes, Greece for eight months now and it uh, has been a crazy road so far. I must say it has been my uh, toughest life uh, so far, but I would say it's totally worth it because um, one day I looked back uh, on my first video how it all started and uh, it makes my heart warm again because uh, that's the point where we decided to leave everything behind, uh, sell everything we had in Estonia, take one suitcase with us, uh, we rented a minibus and we drove uh, from Estonia to Athens in uh, three days. Uh, we were uh, switching drivers uh, all the time and slept uh, while we can, uh, could. And uh, we came all the way from Estonia to Poland, uh, Slovakia, Slovenia, Hungary, Romania, Bulgaria and Greece. So to look back how crazy the road was, can't believe it because um, the most awful uh, drive we had was uh, during the night time in uh, Romania where people drove, drove like crazy and it was raining. So. We basically prayed for our lives uh, all the time to get get to Greece in one piece. Yeah, if you want to watch this video, it's the first video I posted without any knowledge about uh, video logs or how to shoot um, any video. But now, now I can uh, make some better videos for you. Today is uh, December the second and uh, everything looks so calm uh, so few people walking around and everything is so quiet in here but uh, when the November started it was the end of the season first day I saw that every, everyone uh, started to building their houses and uh, renovating apartments 
and it uh, totally changed in one day so it was like that one day we had tourists and uh, summer season and the second day everyone uh, were switching to construction work uh, renovating their apartments and houses local people were chilling in local uh, coffee shops and uh, basically gathering around 15 or 20 people in one table talking and enjoying uh, winter season I finally got a remote job and I'm uh, working in a call center customer service, service and so on so most of my days uh, I spend there to work as much as I can at the moment because uh, I'm preparing for uh, another season to make uh, more and better videos for you all Sometimes it's uh, really hard to work when your neighbor is uh, renovating your apartment and jackhammer is uh, slamming on the next uh, wall you have and it's a little bit complicated but uh, so far it's good it's good that I have some kind of uh, income at the moment because uh, it helps me to pay some bills and uh, now in November we are receiving all the electricity bills uh, from summer so it was a new thing for us because the bills were were not uh, so small so basically we are eating pasta every day at the moment because it's the cheapest uh, option and uh, all salary I get will go to the paying bills and rent so it's a shame but we try to handle it uh, no Christmas presents this year but we are okay with it because we don't have to live in Estonia at the moment where there is uh, one meter snow and uh, cold so yeah I think we made the right choice to come here in Greece because at the moment, uh, today, December the 2nd, we have 22 degrees outside and the water is even warmer because uh, one day I went to swim and it feels like uh, in the water it was uh, much warmer than outside and it uh, felt like uh, swimming in summer. It may be uh, 22 degrees outside, but even I am wearing a jacket, which is in my backpack at the moment, because the temperature is, uh, yeah, it's high, but uh, humidity is uh, quite high also. So, in the middle of the summer, our uh, apartment uh, owners uh, brought us uh, many blankets and uh, carpets and we were wondering why we need them but now we know because uh, if the sun goes down and you live in an apartment it's uh, really really cold we also uh, bought some more blankets to wrap around ourselves in it so it's totally different than in Estonia we reached to Mandraki port and as you can see it's so quiet in here no salespersons all the boats are docked and uh, nothing really goes around in here but uh, when it, the November started all the Christmas decorations were up and uh, in the middle of this video I will show you some uh, Christmas uh, lights all around Rhodes in Greece uh, in the night time. So at the end of this video I will show you how it's uh, looking. I wanted to remind you that uh, I made a campaign where this year we are sending out uh, Christmas postcards to our subscribers 
so take part of it because it really makes me happy if I can send out uh, Christmas postcards to my uh, followers and uh, all you have to do is subscribe to our YouTube channel and go to rodases.com where you find a shop and uh, at that shop we have a free Christmas card uh, option where you can uh, put on the details where can I send this uh, postcard so so far I have uh, nine orders I think it was uh, three orders from Germany two from uh, England three from uh, Estonia and even uh, United States so please take part of it it makes me really happy if I have a bunch of postcards uh, which I have to send out and this uh, campaign is uh, valid until December 10th where I make a special video about it and I also send out all the postcards uh, to your mailbox they are all uh, handwritten by me and it's a little holiday greetings from uh, warm uh, Rodas. On my webpage rodases.com you may also see that I started a fundraiser uh, to collect some money for better camera gear because this one is giving up on me and uh, won't work half of the time so it's uh, really hard to make some videos. So my uh, goal is to gather enough money for my birthday which is uh, January January 14th and I know at my current salary I can buy it myself uh, maybe until in the middle of the summer next year so it's really hard to ask for help but um, if you want to know what I do most of my evenings then uh, I I watch videos about the new camera gear and how uh, I can edit some cool new videos and it's uh, like an obsession already to get it for my birthday and uh, by the way a few days back I realized that I'm turning uh, 35 this year and I haven't asked anything big for Christmas or birthdays so it's my one dream that I want to achieve I even uh, thought to write some emails to some companies uh, or government maybe they can help me get this camera gear faster because uh, otherwise my next season is uh, pretty boring and I can do what I love the most to make videos if you have a wish uh, that you want to send a gift for me then you're all welcome you can find the link uh, on my rodases.com website or uh, YouTube channel uh, front page so doesn't matter the amount everything helps a lot and I really want to thank a few people who already donated some money so I can save up every cent I have to get a better uh, camera gear and uh, start making some cool videos my gimbal is uh, giving up uh, it shuts down uh, most of the times and my camera which is my phone at the moment uh, won't work uh, at all so I have to shoot videos many times to get the proper one but yeah if you if you want to support somehow then you're all welcome I'm really glad if you can do that and I appreciate it Rodos has some really cool Christmas decorations and uh, they were up uh, in the beginning of the November already you can see this at the end of my video but 
right now I wanted to show you where local people are gathering every day. One place is uh, Aktion, which is uh, near the Mandraki port, and it's full of people all the time. So it's really nice to see that some places which are open are for locals. And uh, yeah. It's so calm in here, some people are fishing, you can uh, smell the sea. Uh, it's so relaxing to be in roads when there are not so many uh, tourists, uh, tourists around, so I really enjoy that. If you decide to look around on my webpage, you can see I uh, made a new designs for t-shirts and hoodies, which are uh, Greece themed uh, hoodies and t-shirts. Uh, I think they're really nice and I can't wait to order a few t-shirts myself, which I can use uh, in my videos. So if you're on my webpage, Go check it out, maybe you can uh, find something you like and uh, also I didn't uh, put much uh, profit margin uh, there also you, because uh, I want to give back as much as I can to my followers. This is Ellie Beach uh, in winter time, as you can see, no uh, umbrellas or sunbeds which uh, make this, uh, make this uh, beach really beautiful and you can have a nice walk in here and enjoy the view because uh, in summertime you basically don't see anything because it's full of people and now I know why this beach is the most beautiful beach in Rodas look at that Calm sea, no people, you can enjoy the beach and I definitely come uh, back here for a swim. All the places are closed and it feels like it's abandoned, but uh, it's a really nice place to be in winter time. I really wish you were here, so start booking, I want to meet you all, don't be afraid to uh, write me or uh, send me a message, if I have free time I really want to meet you all. One thing I really miss about uh, moving to Rhodos in Greece is that uh, it's a lonely life, I don't have many friends here and uh, it's weird that you really can't go out with your friends and uh, grab some drinks or something and just talk. I have a few friends uh, from Estonia who sometimes call me or vice versa and we can talk but uh, it's not the same. I am really happy that I made uh, new friends this season. Um, Christy from uh, United States, my biggest fan so far. And uh, we decided to exchange some packages because uh, there are some things that uh, she wants from uh, Rhodes, Greece and some things I, I'd like to have from United States to try. So after the crazy Christmas season is over, we try to send uh, each other a package. I also made some new friends from uh, Ireland, UK, Estonia, and I'm really, really happy about that. So I wish I meet you all 
and uh, make new friends all over the world. So this has been the uh, toughest uh, time in my life where I uh, burned all the bridges and came to Rhodes, Greece and basically started a YouTube channel from uh, scratch. So it hasn't been uh, easy for me or anyone else, I think, because YouTube is really hard to get people to comment, like, share, engage somehow and uh, gather subscribers, build a community. But uh, it has taught me a lot more than my previous years. It has been the toughest year I have. But uh, I think I have learned the most during that time and get some new skills. So I really, really like to thank you all who, who are watching my videos, have subscribed and uh, messaged me someday. So that makes me smile. I don't smile uh, often, but when I do, I smile uh, with my heart. We are now in Newtown and uh, I wanted to show you a place which is uh, full all the time, summertime and winter time. So this is the place where local people gather, talk, enjoy. In here you can feel that uh, the life is going on, people are socializing, it's uh, buzzing. I have seen a lot of uh, baby showers uh, after the summer season and weddings. <laughs> Yeah, some uh, local places are open, but uh, most of the shops and uh, hotels and places in Newtown are all closed. And they start uh, renovating and opening next year around March, April, March. So they are preparing for new season then. Seems like local people are doing uh, Christmas shopping already and uh, I also have a random uh, tip for you if you're uh, buying something online then uh, select the items you want, put them in your cart and uh, fill, up the, fill up the details for ordering but uh, don't complete the uh, order yet because uh, most of the times uh, 6 hours or 24 hours later you get a uh, discount code on your mail so you can buy it cheaper so this is how most of the online jobs are uh, built so if you don't finish your order now then uh, they try to they try to as you see sometimes I just forget the English words what I want to say but what I wanted to say is that if you don't finish your order then uh, in few time they send you a discount code on your mail so you could uh, complete the order I wanted to talk a little bit about this uh, skate park near uh, the beginning of uh, Newtown 
and when I walked by here uh, in the start of the November this whole uh, area was uh, full of uh, people who didn't have home so there was like hundreds of uh, homeless people all the clothes were hanging wherever they could but uh, I have no idea where they moved now there were some uh, families some houses built with cardboard and uh, yeah it was uh, crazy to see that now I have uh, noticed that some people live in a tent near the beach as I said everyone is building something and I think it uh, continues until the next season I don't even have an idea what they built here but uh, all the chefs and waitresses have uh, switched to construction work all over the town so it's a progress We have a quite heavy rain here in Rhodos, Greece every second day and it's something we have to get used to because uh, we have a lot of thunderstorms and the rain most of the time and I wanted to shoot this video even earlier but it was a really windy day so I couldn't so I hope uh, next free day I have from work I can shoot another video I already heard some uh, cruise ship uh, sending some uh, alarms to come back to the ship so I think now the new, new old town is uh, all closed up and it feels like a coast town let's find out Everything is so quiet in uh, Old Town and I try to wrap up this video because my phone battery is dying. I really want to thank you all for uh, watching this video and uh, also go uh, check my website rodoses.com maybe you find a cool merch from there some cool t-shirts and hoodies and uh, yeah, please take part of this uh, Christmas card uh, campaign I have until December 10th because I want to send out as much postcards I can to my subscribers and uh, take part of it. It's something different because uh, you don't get a postcard every year so it's a good opportunity for me and you to have this postcard from, from Greece. Thank you all for watching, see you next time.